Hold on. Can we smoke? Yeah, I'll you can smoke in here, bro. Come on. Right now? Jet, um, it's Young down. Hollywood, right? He's fine. I have no Is it okay? I don't smoke. smoke in here? I don't smoke. Uh, yeah, yeah, I don't smoke. Oh, walk up. Oh, my God. I'm Oliver Trevina here on the Young Hollywood sofa with these two guys. What's up? Natural born pranksters. Thanks for having us, yes. man. Yeah, Dennis, this place is Roman, awesome, dude. And uh, Vitaly. Vitaly. Vitaly's here. Vitaly's come and morphed into Georgie for this uh, segment only. So Roman and Dennis is doing an interview with Young Hollywood. I'm coming in late from a bar because I didn't sleep yet. Obviously I did, but I'm going to act like I'm super drunk and pass out. Let's see what's going to happen. I was a bit worried about you guys coming in. Why? But you, well, because, well, the obvious, the pranks and stuff. I really didn't know what I was going to get. And now the fact that he's not here, I keep thinking that something well, is going to happen. Dude, you would worry if you were coming to our place. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're, we don't have any control. I was worried walking into this place. Okay. I thought we were going to get Look pranked. at that. We were both worried. Yeah. And we yeah. had nothing to we're be worried We're all paranoid. About. We're all in the same business. We're all man. paranoid. It's pretty mind blowing watching what you guys do. Does it not get scary? Like, do you not ever think, okay, I can't keep doing this? Like, well, yeah, there was a time in Finland where I literally... I've never seen him have a, a real-life heart attack. I he literally... Was, he was holding his arm, pounding his I'm chest. I'm like in Finland, like, hey, guys, I can't, I can't do this on a heart attack. They're going to go kidnap a girl in front of the cops. And, and throw her in the trunk. Right? Throw her in the it, trunk. It sounds bad, right? It's a usual weekend. We go in front of the police station. We throw this girl in the trunk. Cops come up, hands on their guns, whatever they're saying. Mita, Mita, I can't remember. And I don't know the name. Is it cool? Oh boy. Well, I mean, why did we. Vitaly, right? Yeah. Vitaly. Vitaly. Yeah, kept going. Does it need a mic? Do you need a drink? No, you don't need a drink. Have a seat. Here, let me get your mic out. This is it. This is it. Come on. Come on. Give me some love. Get some. Come on. Oh, I love it. Woo! You smell good. Have you worked, you've worked out as well, haven't you? Look at them guns. Yeah. Do you have water for me? Water? Here, here. I got one right here. Let's go through your shirt. Are you gonna don't up. throw up, dude? Please don't. Bro, throw should up. we switch spots? You've worked. You've been working out. Working on this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have so you got shaking. any action recently? He's so shaking. Why are you alright? So we throw this. I chick. love this. I love we, drunk people. We throw this chick in the trunk. <laughs> cops run up, hands on their gun, and when the cops pop the trunk, we have an exact replica dummy in what the are trunk. You talking about? And she'd crawl through the back seat. And it dude. Just like, yeah. So when they open up the trunk, there's a. Uh, we're talking about yeah, the kidnapping. We're talking about the thing in Finland. Yeah. Where what they about me? The girl. It's you not about want... you right now. You were late. What's you guys want to be here? Hey, hey, hey. Huh? We will in a minute. We will in a minute. Eat this. You guys want some candy? Eat some candy. Come on, continue your Finland story. Yeah. Like open bar. Yo, so we're in Finland. I'm supposed to kidnap this girl for the prank. Yeah. And I was supposed to go, and I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I have a movie coming out. We right. know. Yeah. Um, what's your personal favorite? If each of you has to li say something from the movie. A oh, the baby swap. Scene. Okay, baby swap. Have you seen? You. Did you get to see it? I haven't seen the movie. No, okay. I was only allowed to watch the trailer. There's a bit where we have a uh, nine-month pregnant woman call her husband home yeah. that she's having the baby right now. I've seen that in the trailer. Okay. Right? Okay. You yeah, that, that's again? that's got to be one. No, I'm not having a baby. We're, We're talking about the baby. movie. We're talking about the movie. We're having the baby. Yeah, dude. So husband shows up, yeah. and that that was one of the f my f my favorite parts. Yeah, no, no, no. Do you want to smoke? For the for the for the. Uh, yeah, I don't think you can smoke in here, bro. Come <laughs> right on. now. Jet. Um, it's it's Young Hollywood, right? It's fine. I have Is no issue. Okay? I don't smoke in here. I don't smoke. Yeah, yeah. I'll walk up. Oh my god. Oh, my phone, dude. You alright? He's out! Hold on, wait. We've I'm killed him. V. I think we gotta get a hotel doctor. Oh. Is he dead? I've kind of, He's in a sick dead. way, I really, really, really He's hope it's true. Just Yo. Around. V. Okay. You alright? I'm in the room. Okay, so, who knows this person? We all, all of us. Do. Anybody? Hello? I mean, I, I've seen him before on YouTube. Are you just gonna leave him here on his, on his stump? Come on. I'm sorry, sir. No one really cares that much. You can do your job. Thank you, sir. I just feel like you you, you could be a paramedic or you could be a stripper. He does look good, doesn't he? He does look good. He, does look he, does look good. Good. he, does look he looks good. too good to be a paramedic. Excuse me. Can you get that? Can you get his? All right. Get him on his side. He's starting. He's starting. Get him on his side. There you go. Uh, drugs? I, mean, uh, I smell THC, marijuana. And who else has been smoking? You? He had a joint. He smoking. Anybody notice, man? Yeah. He's just he's just been drinking. That's it. Good. Hello. Vitaly, oh, hey. talk to me. You okay? There ain't nothing wrong with this man. He's just <laughs> drunk. Uh, uh, <laughs> I wasn't worried. I was like, I hope he's dead. He didn't even 
bro. I've seen dead people all the time from overdoses. It doesn't matter. I went to the bar to put a bottle on myself to stick like that. You do look too good for the part, though. You do look like a stripper. He's got to be honest. Well, I mean, that's next. The tan, the Can we do that? Everything. Then I'll get involved. Take your clothes off and I'll jump in. I am a real paramedic. Are you really? Yeah. Girls purposely pass out in front of us. Oh, I know? can see that. Help me! <laughs> and men. <laughs> so clearly, you love doing what you do. Oh, yeah. Yes, yeah, we're always goofing off. We're always, uh, you know, even even if it fails, it's still fun. That's right, where right. we're we'll always at. We'll call it the walk so. of shame, though. We, coming into this, coming right. into this whole thing, we're like, it's going to fail so hard. But we're like, let's still do it. Let's have fun with oh, it. Oh, no, I love it. As I said, I wanted I wanted a prank to happen. Yeah. I think if he didn't look so much like a stripper, I would have believed it. Millions and billions, well, billions of views on, on your stuff. Yeah. Is, it, is it more pressure now? Because obviously, the more people that watch it, do you, do you feel more pressure to come up with of new course. ideas? A lot of pressure. Very much a so. Lot. Yeah. You always tried to top your last right, video. Right. I so. mean, my pranks are so scattered now, like literally months apart now. They used to be every week. Right, right. So there is a lot of pressure and you always try to have to one up yourself. And If, if I was going to prank someone tonight, I've really never done any pranks, which surprises me because I feel like I'd, oh my I'd be God. good at it. Yeah, yeah I've not done, not done any. If I was going to prank someone, three tips for me. Um, Don't be scared. Yeah, do it. <laughs> have okay. Some do it and then like, it's always Really good if you can be have confident. Can be you confident. come up with a prank for me right now? Right now, yeah. You know what you could do? Prank you could light up a joint and pass out. No, you know what I would do? <laughs> this is true. You know what I, this is true. And have an extremely good looking man come say, like, Yeah. Okay. And I like, you know, I just did one where, you know, you, you, you have the taxi driver pull up to pick you up, right? And you come out with your suitcases and he load them up and then you come out with a little bit more suitcases and now he's committed because he has about his trunk is full, maybe a back seat's full. So he's not going anywhere. You have them. Then you come out with like a big box. Then maybe like a TV, then a maybe bucket a plant, of water, a bucket of water, a canoe, a big giant ball for the it. beach, yeah, and you just keep doing they just it. Keep going. They won't say no. And then they they, some of them will say no, yeah, but it's it on hilarious. The top of their you home. should try this. You wash them, like some of them, depending on the driver, I guess. Like we've done one where he went all the way. Oh, the whole roof of his car. He tied he with actually ropes. he actually pulled out bungees, like this is for <laughs> real, and he's just like doosh, doosh. take a sticker with a letter B on it. Walk up, put it on someone's back, and then have your buddy go by and say, "Oh my God, you got a bee, a bee, a bee, a bee!" And they start taking their clothes off and throwing their stuff. Yeah. I'm allergic to bees. I don't know how you guys are friends because Us. I just live in fear around you. When I got into my hotel last night, the first thing I do is I check the entire hotel, every spot behind every mirror, behind every this picture, is. under every bed, everywhere I go. It's like a setup. Like, nope. This hotel was booked ahead of time. I know they came in here and rigged it. Right. You know, airbag under the mattress. Something's gonna happen to me. <laughs> I honestly don't think I'd feel feel happy about seeing you in public. I think if I saw you in public, I'd run the other way. And for that reason, it's gone well so far. I'm going to wrap this up. <laughs> Natural born pranksters. He's not dead. He's not no. dead. It's a prank. It's a prank.